was recently contacted by Vogue Race to collaborate with them. Vogue Race is a professional production manufacturer and supplier for custom keychains, acrylic charms, acrylic keychains, enamel pins, and so much more. I had been on the hunt trying to figure out how to make my own enamel pins and acrylic keychains, so they couldn't have contacted me at a more perfect time to be honest. I had never worked with a manufacturer before, so this is all new to me. I'm beyond pleased with how Vogue Race operates though. They replied in a very timely manner, they answered all of my questions that I had, and they made me feel very comfortable throughout the entire process. Overall, I had six different designs made into acrylic keychains, and I'm going to review each one to let you know my honest feelings on the overall order. So here's the actual review of the keychains themselves. Here's the box that Vogue Race sent the keychains in, kept them very well protected, I have no complaints. Let's go ahead and dump all of these out. Alright, so here we go. And as you can see, each design gets its own little personal bag, and I got a sample keychain, and we'll take a closer look at that at the end. So I got a total of one, two, three, four, five six, seven designs, and I also got these extra keychain clasps. So around, I believe I said six earlier, but it is seven designs in total. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at each and every single design. They each come in these little baggies, which I absolutely love. They're very cute and reusable for whenever you ship this off to the buyer. So I went ahead and switched out my background so you could see everything just a little clearer. And here is my first design. This is a little froggy switch. As you can see, it is double-sided. Here's the clasp. I love these clasps. I think they are so cute and they seem to be very high quality. Like they're not just going to randomly break on you, which is awesome. Each of these designs, I believe, does have a protective layer over them to protect each keychain during shipping. So as you can see, it has this protective little film over it. So each keychain looks really nice whenever you send it, whenever you send it to the buyer. See how glossy and protected that is? Absolutely stunning. The print quality is amazing. I mean, I'm very happy with how all of these turned out. This one is definitely one of my favorites, and like I said, that film is on both front and back. So here's this first design. This one has little glitters on it, and the clasp is different. So what I really love about this is that it's sparkly. Let me go ahead and peel this layer off so you can get a better look at this. So here it is without that protective layer on it and as you can see the sparkles look amazing. I mean this is so shiny it's almost reflective and if you can't tell what this design is this is the pink palace from the movie Coraline and if you can tell there's Coraline and there is the little cat and of course I thought that the cat clasp would match this design the best. So here is this one. I'm absolutely obsessed with this one. I love the way that it turned out. Have you ever drawn a house before? No, but do I think that I, I really nailed it with this one? Yeah. <laughs> Coming in next, this is probably my favorite design that I did. And it is Sailor Moon on top of a Nintendo Switch. Kind of going along with the whole Switch theme that I have going on. I love drawing game consoles, what can I say? So here is this one. If you can tell, let me see if I can get a little closer. You can see some small little glitters on here. And I just love the way that looks. I haven't taken the protective layer off yet, but also look at how nice and thick these are. They look great. And for the clasp, I chose the star. I'm very happy with how these turned out. I mean, they're very thick. They're gonna last a long time. And with these metal clasps and even the ones that look like this, in my opinion, these are really high quality. And I'm so, so happy that Vogue Race reached out to me because holy crap. I've been wanting to do something like this forever and this has just, it's blown my mind that how amazing this is. So here's the Sailor Moon one. 
Next, I designed one of my favorite Pokemon of all time, and that is Snorlax. He comes with a little till blue clasp, and this one does not have any glitter on it, but he still looks really cute. <laughs> um, this one is not double-sided, though. I do have to say that. The back of this one peeled off really easily. The only thing that I do have to say about every one of these is that the protective layer is very hard to take off. That one, I think that you could have seen that it looked like it had a small tab that you could put pill. And as you can see, the front does not have that. So I have to really search for a way to peel that off. So, but I really love the way this one turned out as well. Snorlax looking all cute. Here's a closer look of him. With this one, I'm not too sure if I ordered the wrong style, but he is matte, as you can see, and not glossy like all of the other ones. So I'm assuming with all of these ones that have this um, colored backing, you get a matte image. I still really love it. I mean, I could even gloss over this to make it more shiny, but I think this one turned out really cute as well. It's Kirby. The star clasp is definitely a favorite of mine. It goes with so many characters and I absolutely love how this one turned out. I actually am on the <laughs> I'm going crazy making all of the Kirby things. If you're a member of my Patreon, then you know last month, I or not last month, but one month, I did a Kirby themed background. I'm going nuts making all of the Kirby stuff. And of course, all of this is going to be available on my Etsy shop. See, that's one of the backgrounds that I made. <laughs> But here is Kirby, just looking a little bit different in a different design. He's matte, very adorable. He's not as thick. <laughs> now with this one, I really do regret the size that I made it because I think that a lot of details got lost. Um, this is Celeste from Animal Crossing and she's supposed to look like she's in this little toy packaging. So if you can see, it says Animal Crossing toy box. And and I put a bunch of little accessories that could be used as like little toys for her and her little packaging. And yeah, I really love this design. I just think that because I made it so small, um, a lot of the smaller details got lost, which I will remember this next time. Um, this has nothing to do with Vogue Grace's uh, fault. It's definitely my own in deciding to make it such a small size. So definitely if you have a design that has a lot of tinier details, you'll want to go on a bigger size, even if it does cost a little bit more. I still think that this is very cute. I mean, it's Celeste in a little toy box. What could, what could possibly go wrong? But it is double-sided and the clasp is a heart this time. Now I'm going to show you my two least favorite designs because I just think that I did not order them correctly. So first I'll start with this one. And I decided to create a chibi image of Rapunzel. And I just don't think it works with the background that I chose. She really blends in. I think that it would have been better to get her on one of these clear ones to see her pop really but that's something else that I'll have, a, have to keep in mind because like I said I've never done anything like this before I've never worked with a manufacturer before yeah I mean other than that I think she's really adorable she's very tiny but I love the clasp and everything else so this one is my least favorite just because I got it in the wrong size so this size really should have been for this one and this one should have been for this size if that makes sense i still love the design don't get me wrong um but it's just a little too large and also the clasp is wrong so it is an animal crossing nintendo ds cartridge as you can see it's huge now if i hold these two side by side this they should have been swapped in sizes and for some reason i did not do that so there's that. This one is not double-sided. So here's this one. It's a little Animal Crossing Wild World cartridge. And like I said, I have a ton of clasps that I can use on my own keychains and artwork and whatnot. And for the sample, this is what this looks like. So it's very cute. It's their little mascot, the golden um, little clasp. And this one ha is like tinted. It looks very nice. 
just an example of what you could do with your art with these. So yeah, here are all of the designs of keychains that I had created by Vogue Race, and overall I am so pleased with how all of this turned out. I mean, I couldn't be more happy to be honest. And like I said, all of these are going to be available on my Etsy shop. I have like six of each. I'm going to keep a couple for myself because I honestly think that they turned out really cute. So some of those will be like five of each. And so if you're thinking of ordering from Vogue Race or maybe you're just looking for a manufacturer, I highly suggest them. And I hope that this helped you guys. Maybe if you're looking to have your art printed or you're looking for little keychains or enamel pins and whatnot, then this will help your decision on what manufacturer to go with. So with some of the keychains, I went through every single one looking for any quality issues and I did find some and I contacted Vogue Race as soon as I found those and they fixed every single issue that I had. So let's go ahead and open this box to see if everything is perfect. So I had a few keychains that had a couple of ink stains or little watermarks on them that just didn't look very presentable. So they went ahead and replaced all of those that I had an issue with. All I did was I shot them an email and I sent them a photo of everything that was wrong and they were super kind and went ahead and sent me all of this. So it did take a couple more weeks to get all of that sorted out, but that was completely fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and open these with you guys to make sure everything looks fine. So here is one of the Sailor Moon keychains. Here's this one, and this one looks really good as well. Good, so no watermarks on the back. And of course, this is just where that plastic film is. Looks good on the front and looks great on the back. So far, all of them look great. And then I got some extra little clasps and I got some more of these little clasps as well. So anything that needed to be replaced, I just sent a photo of and they replaced it very fast. Now that I reviewed the keychains themselves, let's talk about a few things you need to know if this is your first time ordering from a product manufacturer. The one thing that I love about Vogue Race is that you're not going back and forth with someone over your design. You submit your design in a PNG file and select the size that you want, keychain style you'd like to have, and they have other options as well as glitter or double-sided features. As someone who has anxiety communicating with others, this really took the stress off of my shoulders and made the process extremely easy to use and access. I did have to teach myself how to create images in CMYK other than RBG, which is what I'm used to illustrating in. But after getting over that hump, it was extremely easy to render my illustrations in CMYK and complete everything in a timely manner. Vogue Race only prints in CMYK, so it's a very important step while creating your illustrations. On each listing, they have very detailed instructions on how each of your files should be submitted. If you have any questions, you can contact them directly and they reply on weekdays in a timely fashion. I placed my order on February 16th and received my package on March 14th. So it took around a month for them to create all of my designs and for it to ship directly to me. I was very happy with the shipping process as well. I thought everything arrived fairly quickly. And overall, if you're new to having your illustrations manufactured, I highly suggest Vogue Grace. The quality of everything is fantastic and the print quality is, is really clear and vibrant. I will be ordering again from Vogue Grace in the future, that is for sure. This will... 100% be my top manufacturer that I will go to. I'm very pleased with everything. If you're unsure about Vogue Race, they can send you a sample pack to let you know what their keychains and, and whatnot look like. But I do highly recommend Vogue Race. I did have a couple of complaints as you saw in my review where I was going over every little thing, but they fixed all of that very quickly and I'm very pleased with everything. I'll put the link to Vogue Race's website in the description box down below and in a pinned comment. And I'll also put my Etsy shop where you can purchase all of these keychains too. But that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. I adore you all. Bye-bye. Smooch.